Well, planes are beginning to circle the skies over Oshkosh as aviation enthusiasts from around the world arrive for EAA Air Venture. This is the show's 40th year in Oshkosh. Organizers are expecting more than 500,000 visitors, including some who travel in packs. Fox 11's Lindsay Baramus explains. For one week each summer, the world of aviation lands in Oshkosh. You're never going to be able to see this anywhere else in the world. You're never going to see so many people enthusiastic about the, the grassroots of aviation. One by one, the plane slid by as bystanders rushed to document the moment. This is the Bonanza arrival. A lot of Bonanza enthusiasts, they get together and they all fly in at one time. And they all land at one time. In fact, with 137 Bonanzas hitting the ground within 20 minutes of each other, this was the largest mass arrival since the group began flying together. That was nearly 20 years ago. Dick Nipinski with Air Venture calls the event Aviation's Family Reunion. And this family is huge. 1,400 acres, 40,000 campers, 500,000 visitors, and it's still growing. It's as big as they come in the world of aviation. It is the world's largest fly-in event. Though the industry has taken a hit from the economy, Nipinski says AirVenture will actually have more exhibitors this year than last. He says companies are focusing their marketing where it matters most. People understand they have to be at Oshkosh because it's the biggest event. And when they come to Air Venture, they know they're going to meet the entire pilot community. Pilots like Tony Lavelle, who's attended the event religiously. Every year since 94, we have friends from all over the world. Uh, we camp with friends from all over that we've met. Uh, friends from Australia, all over Minnesota. Lavelle says he enjoys his time in the sky, but was happy to keep planet on the ground in these conditions. Watch how much fun it is to try to land a plane in this wind. <laughs> but shaky or smooth, he says when planes dot the sky, it's an awesome sight. In Oshkosh, Lindsay Veramis, Fox 11 News. AirVenture officials expect attendance will hold steady from last year. The celebration officially kicks off on Monday. The first air show will begin at 3.30. Now, the event runs through Sunday, August 2nd, with gates opening at 7 a.m. every day. Some of the main events include an appearance by the U.S. Airways pilots who successfully landed a plane in the Hudson River, saving 155 people. The Doobie Brothers will perform opening night at 6 p.m., and ventriloquist Jeff Dunham will perform August 1st at 8 p.m.